Hey guys, I'm back with another interesting tutorial for you and today we're going to talk about how to install macOS Sierra into a flash drive so you'll be able to install it on your Mac and perhaps on a virtual drive like I did. So, first things first, all you need is a at least a 16GB USB drive. 8GB uh, is also cool but not sure if it will all fit there so it might ask for extra space and whatnot. Therefore, I recommend 16 gigabyte. Then, of course, you need the macOS Sierra developer app in your app folder, and uh, this will be, uh, you know, mixed uh, into a bundle and put on your USB drive. Therefore, it's very important to have it in your Mac app folder. All right, and um, let's get started. So, first, I open the terminal window right here. So, first things first. I will copy all the commands right here in the terminal window. It's real easy, just copy and paste. And like I said, make sure that your drive is named exactly like this or copy your USB drive's name and replace it right here. And then all you have to do is press enter. And there you go. So it will ask maybe for your uh, administrative password it didn't ask for me because I already did that and uh, bear in mind that your uh, flash drive will be completely erased so save all your files somewhere else now this might take a while therefore I will uh, pause the video and come back when it's finished right, and after the install is complete you should be able to see this uh, uh, message on your um, terminal window and if you open up what's on your flash drive, you will see an install macOS Sierra developer preview icon. If you double click that, of course, you'll be prompted if you want to install that on your main computer. Although I don't encourage this because it might get broken. This is the first developer preview. So don't install this on your main laptop, computer, uh, Apple device. I recommend the uh, you install this on your hard drive, an external USB uh, flash drive, external hard drive as well. Uh, nothing that's already inside your computer. So don't even partition your hard drive into two or three bits and install it on one partition. Install it on something external. Let me in the comment section below if this was helpful and if you managed to install this on your uh, external hard drive or your uh, virtual machine. Also guys, if you like my videos, make sure you check out my other videos I made on this channel. And if you really like what I'm doing and you want to stay up to date with everything I do, just hit the subscribe button and you will get notified of the latest updates. 